and welcome back to another video. Um, so I was on Wish and I saw these headphones. I was getting some Nintendo Switch stickers, which will to decorate my Switch, which I will also probably be doing a review of. Um, but I got this. I decided to get these and have, take a look at them because they were heavily discounted. I think it was like seventy odd percent. So it's like, eh, might as well get them, check them out because I don't really have any really nice headset headphones. Like I think. These are my nicest, and the, uh, while these do hold some nostalgic memories, because I used to wear these in college, and everyone was joking um, how they could never lose either, because they just need to look for these, because I always had these on um, when I got my MP3 player, and um, because tell me deal with loud environments and uh, um, tell me concentrate uh, during work, um, so, so I just decided to get these, um, and I have opened it uh, opened it already, yes, to take a quick look at them, and it, uh, um, it came in this condition, now it's been beaten there, bent there, and there, yeah, so not very good right now, so Hunter Spider, V1, colourful backlight, soft ear corpse, Rotatable microphone, plug in to a game controller, pro gaming headset, 3.5mm pin, supports uh, mobiles, tablets, laptops, PS4 and Xbox One, and according to Wish, also Switch. Um, that's why it popped up when I was looking for the Switch stickers, because it's like a little weird switching them. Uh, products, uh, payments, uh, speaker uh, size, 40mm. Im impedance 18 omega plus 15 percent sensitivity 108 plus 3 db frequency range 20 hertz to 20 kilohertz uh, microphone 6.0 times 5.0 millimeters microphone sensitivity minus 38 plus 3 db microphone impedance 2.2 k oh uh, Omega. I think that's Omega. I, I'm not exactly sure. I can't remember off the top of my head, but it's that little symbol there. Oh, you can't really see too well. Anyway, it, it's like line and then an upside down horseshoe. It's basically an upside down horseshoe with the ends bit uh, beaten in. Uh, directionally, omni directional. Capable cable length 2.1 meters plus uh, 0.15. LED working volt, oh pardon me, working voltage DC 5V plus 5%. Working currency, uh, 500 milliamps amps hour MA. Head jack USB plus uh, 3.5 millimeter for pin. So, um, here is the headset in question, and it. And it does look quite nice. Um, I haven't turned it on yet, but yeah. And there's uh, the microphone, which slides into there, which I think is really cool. I've never, I don't think I've seen a headset do that before now, so that is actually quite cool. Down here we have like a volume adjustment and microphone on and off switch. And um, here we have. The USB, so I'm presuming that's for to power the thing, um, you know, all the lights and everything, and the, the, the headphone jack. Now, here's something that's really interesting. It came with this, which splits it between um, headphones and microphone. Now, what I want to test here is, how does the microphone work? Does this work with my capture card? So, I will be doing some tests with this, but I'm not going to be doing that right now. Right now, I'm going to watch some YouTube videos with these. Um, just stick them in there. Remove put that over there. That in there. Oh yeah! Do I look hashtag pro or what? Anyway. Um, because I don't want to get flagged for having other people's videos in my video. I'll come back to you after I've watched some YouTube videos, I won't need that down for that, but yeah, um, I'll wear these for a while, and yeah, so far they're quite comfy, they're not um, pressing down on my ears too much, 
um, just the right size actually. Quite nice. So yeah, I'll come back to you once I've watched some YouTube videos. Also, right now I've got my computer on my TV screen, which is over there, where I usually have it on my computer screen. But I feel like I felt like having it on my TV screen today, so I have it on my TV screen. So if that's why you're wondering why I'm looking over there, that's why. See you guys in a minute, or well, in a few, after like an hour or so, when I've watched a few YouTube videos. Bye bye, for now. Bye bye for now. So because of how my computer was um, like. Um, headphone jack on the top of my computer is a bit iffy and it only works on the right headphone no matter what I use and I did double check and these uh, both of these do work because I checked on my switch um, but and while I was checking on my switch it did sound nice so yes the sound is quite good um, and it, uh, surprisingly enough on top of my head and the analysis just um, to like when the uh, to show some people because um, when I was listing off all the measurements and everything earlier uh, there would have been a bunch of people who didn't know you know didn't really get the measurements and stuff so let me just show you this quickly over there is my Nintendo switch you can see it yeah and the wire just like goes from there all the way over here to me and I think I sh might even be able to uh, I can't, this is, a, this is as far back as I can go uh, without my switch falling off. So yeah, it is a really good length because it's basically going halfway across the room. And this, I'm bearing in mind, mind this is in the biggest room, but that is still impressive. Um, because most of my headphones probably don't even go that far. I don't think the, these ones earlier that I showed earlier, I don't think they go that far. So, um, I'm going to take these off now. What I am going to do now quickly is, now this is, this part is going to be more relevant to my channel because I've been trying to find the um, headphones that work for my capture card but the only, well microphone, but the only microphones I've ever had that might even work with it haven't worked very well. So let's test these out and see how they work with the capture card. Bearing in mind this is more if it doesn't work, it's probably just due to my capture card. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to do two tests. And I'm going to record two sets of footage. So, the first set of footage is just going to be me playing Smash Bros. Ultimate. Uh, one round of Smash Bros. Ultimate. Just with uh, this. And then the second uh, set of footage will uh, be with just uh, the um, microphone on here. Just to test out both. Um, just to see how both work. Because I don't want to... Just assume that this is going to be the best way, or this is going to be the best way of recording sound on it. So I'm gonna do some testing, and I'll be right. Well, you'll be see, you'll see the video, and then I'll basically give a summary of what we saw in the footage afterwards. Okay, so I've just watched uh, um, the two recordings quickly. The first recording where it was just um, the jack normally, you couldn't hear me at all, so it didn't work at all. Um, so it would just literally be the gameplay. So I'm not going to show you that because I don't want to get into too much trouble with Nintendo. And you know, it's just like that would just basically be uploading gameplay and music set without any commentary. So we're even with commentary, it's a little bit iffy, but um, right now the audio that is being recorded is being recorded through this mic so you can all, so you can hear how good it is. And it, uh, yeah, let me just quickly go and it, um, edit this in and it, um, you know, uh, let me show you how uh, good the audio was in the actual gameplay and I actually do have some commentary around it. Uh, it, it, it uh, while I was swiveling it around to make sure I was um, checking to make sure the audio was right, it did do a little bit zip, a little bit biz, but that's only for one second. Um, but the audio is pretty much perfect, the rest of the um, me playing the game, so yeah. Uh, this will actually now allow me to use my capture card properly. Yay! I don't know, I do it like that. It's just be like, yeah, yeah, I don't know. Cheese, Gromit, cheers. Anyway, um, so I am actually quite chuffed about that. Is chuffed a British thing? 
Is it not a British thing? I think it's a British thing. Anyway, um, I am quite chuffed about that. So, yeah, this is actually quite good. The audio is good, the microphone is good, the, um, the fact that you can um, add that thing on, which not only gives you a little bit extra length, if, just in case you need it, but it also um, basically allows me now. So, um, I am currently... I currently have my headphone uh, headphones put in, and uh, this way, you know, this will now mean that I could um, say, video call one of my friends or play a game on my computer while capt capturing my um, voice, and it shouldn't have an echo because that was a bit of a problem before. I do know. Um, I think I did come up with another solution to that, but I've completely forgotten it. <laughs> um, I think it was probably just like mute desktop audio and just go off the camera, but that would just be a bit bad. Anyway. Um, so yeah, I would definitely suggest picking these up if you, oh excuse me, if you are in the market for a new headset because, um, also, um, I just want to plug that in quickly just so I can have the lights on. Yeah, lights. Yeah, now they're changing to, there we go, now you can see both the lights. Yeah, well, oh, that, that is quite nice, the lights. Um, yeah. My uh, one and only complaint, and I'm not going to really mention bring up the box damage because that's not really wishes or... Well, it might be wishes, but it's not really the manufacturer's fault. That's more of the fault of the courier service, which might be wishes, but it could be not wishes. I don't know. Anyway. Um, but, yeah, the... Uh, the the only thing uh, um, what that I can say that I don't like about these is that my ears are getting a bit sweaty. Um, they are they do they were getting a bit hot in there, and uh, um, you know if you're going to be wearing these for a long period of time, I wouldn't suggest that. I would probably suggest taking a few minutes break um, every once in a while to take them off um, because my ears were starting to get a bit hot and and they're a bit uncomfortable so I would suggest taking them off every once in a while and just like put them around your neck like this and just give your ears a break and then when you're done pop them back on you know, it mainly is just cooling your ears off because um, if I can show these while I can talk um, this bit here yeah you can still hear me this bit here that doesn't that isn't going on top of my ears that's going around my ears. Uh, if I can show that, it sort of goes around my ears like that. And there's plenty of room and it doesn't make my ears crap, cramp. But the problem is, it is very well insulated. Like, in the winter, you're probably not going to have um, any trouble with your ears getting too warm. But um, in the warmer weather, um, you're probably going to, in the warmer months, you're probably going to have a bit of trouble with your ears getting warm. Which is definitely something that um, you may find trouble with, um, and you might want to have. Uh, but if you have a you know night, a proper cooling, like just have a fan next to you, then uh, that should probably stop your ears from getting too hot. It's just the fact that um, you know, as most people know, there's a lot of blood vessels around the ears, so a lot of heat escapes around there. Same with your hands and your feet. Um, a lot, a lot of blood vessels around there, especially your wrists. Um, lots of blood vessels there, so a lot of heat escapes from your hands. Your, uh, I've done about your neck, probably your neck, your ears, and your feet. I definitely know your hands, wrists, and ears do. I, not to hundred percent sure on my neck. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much it. I'll see you guys in the next video. Now enjoy the um. Or me playing Smash Bros Ultimate with Little Mac. Um, I had this a shame because the first one I actually won and the second one I lost. And it's just like, yeah. Of course the one that match I actually win, the audio doesn't work at all. Anyway, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye bye. So I was just going through editing this video quickly. And uh, just, I never no noticed like... The di I just noticed the difference between two recordings, so I think this is uh, the one with like the microphone on my web webcam. Yeah. So you should uh, be, be able to hear that, so very quiet and not too good. And then there's uh, this. Okay, so 
which is a lot better. So yes, I'm definitely going to be using this microphone for all of my recordings. Prepare, prepare to see a lot more of these guys. Anyway, I just wanted to point that out because it is just so much better. So yeah, my, vi my video quality has gone up by about 10%. Now if only I could actually learn to edit. Ah, ah. Yeah, maybe, well, maybe one day if I actually make this into like a um, profitable thing. Well, probably not. Like, I'd have to get uber lucky doing that. And I have always said, I am quite skillful, but the one thing that holds me back in everything uh, is my bad luck. I always get really bad luck. Like, um, you know, I'll be like watching an area in a first person shooter looking for enemies and then somebody will come up behind me and kill me that's how bad my luck is and I could and I could li and it, uh, I, I'm not bad at I'm I'm not like my, I'm not bad at games but my luck my bad luck basically counteracts my um skill so sort of they sort of neutralize each other making it so that I'm not that good at games um well, like, well, I'm not god at video games. It's not like I'm really good at every game, but most games where that I can usually like outskill my bad luck. But a lot, lot of the time, I just bad. I have a lot of bad luck. Um. So yeah, that's probably why I'll never get a lot of subscribers because I just don't have the luck to do it. And sure, there'll probably be somebody down in the comments just like, "Oh, you're just blaming the bad luck for you sucking." And it's like, I really don't care if you say that. It's like you just wasted like five minutes of your time. Anyway, see you guys in the next video this time. Bye bye. I'm just double checking I got that right. Hopefully, this isn't causing like weird audio on that. Uh, yeah, microphone. There we go. Right, little Mac again. Find the level 9 AI. Let's go. Oh, we have Link. Oh, it's Shadow Link Link. Skin. Shadow Link Skin Link. Link skin. There should be a Shadow Link Echo Fighter for Link. Now, Shadow Link, uh, well, Link, sorry, um, is actually one of the characters I don't like playing against as Lil Mac because um, his sword just gives him a natural advantage. Also, ranged characters, I don't like fighting against them. And uh, Link, all of the Links are very uh, mobile, which means that they just. they just out. Uh, Maneuver me in the air. Oh, that shield that's saving me. Oh, he predict Ah, I have a sword now, Link. I was about to say, now we're on equal footing with him. He just did that. Uh, as we found out, Link is one of the better level 9 AIs. So, yeah. I need to watch uh, what I'm doing. Oh, shoot! What did he. Oh, oh, wait. Some sharp shooting there from the Hero of the Wild. Is that, is that his official title? Is it Hero of the Wild? I could be wrong, but I'm pretty sure it's Hero of the Wild. The Ilmark and Link's up B is, is basically the same, except Link does his with a sword. It's all gone quiet. It's spooky! Oh, there we go. I think I'm using something back now. Okay, this thing needs to die. Oh, no! Oh! Yeah! You're definitely dead. Oh! 
Oh! What was that, Link? I can't see shit, but I can see you dying. Oh, wait. Shit. Oh! Yeah! Not often I get to land one of them. Oh, get the fake smash ball. Ow. No! Was that just a god level play from Link there? You guys should see my face right now. Unfortunately, you can't. Yeah, just like god level play from Link there. So, let's see how this audio actually turned out. See, let's see if it's good or not, but if it's probably not good, it's probably due to the cabbage card. Um, uh, but if, it, if it's not good, then I do have a plan B to test out how good this mic actually is. Uh, but hopefully this audio should be fine. Anyway, I'll see you guys uh, in just a minute.